The Internet Protocol, or ICP, was one of the most widely discussed projects launched in 2021, largely due to the fact that immediately after launch, ICP managed to briefly become one of the top 10 largest cryptocurrencies by market capitalization. So in today's video, we're going to explore the story of Internet Computer, and by the end of this video, you'll know everything about it and its cryptocurrency, and a lot more, so keep watching the video. The world has been intrigued by cryptocurrency and crypto mining for almost a decade now, this virtual or digital currency is secured by cryptography, which makes it almost difficult to fake or double spend. Now, while many cryptocurrencies are technically on a decentralized network based on blockchain technology enforced by various networks of computers, this may not be the entire picture. The entire internet that we use today is controlled by only a couple of technology giants. All crypto relies on storage, websites, and application interfaces. These gatekeepers include Amazon, Google, Facebook, etc. It's only a handful of companies that control the entire internet. These companies also get to decide the fate of a cryptocurrency market. A simple barring of crypto companies from using their services should immediately put a halt to all crypto as we know it. But this is where the Internet Computer Protocol, or ICP, comes into the picture. Welcome to What the Asset YouTube channel. Here we listen to our subscribers and educate them on everything related to financial assets. We discuss topics like cryptocurrency, stocks, bonds, ETFs, you name it in an easy way. So if you're looking for more of these kind of videos, definitely subscribe to our YouTube channel. So now, let's get straight to the topic. Okay, so let's figure out what Internet Computer is. The Internet Computer was first founded in 2016 by Dfinity, and it's a digital token that uses its own registered protocol named Internet Computer Protocol. It lets anyone publish content or build software without using services from the tech giants mentioned earlier. And the basic idea behind ICP is to allow people to build a new open internet, giving users a better deal. Dfinity founder Dominic Williams says that this new protocol is a hack-proof platform that will help bring down user costs. ICP uses the same idea as other blockchain cryptocurrencies, which use smart contracts or codes serving as an agreement between users. So how does it work? The internet computer uses an algorithm called Threshold Relay, a modification of the proof-of-stake algorithm to attain an agreement. Proof-of-stake is what the Ethereum cryptocurrency uses for its consensus, which requires users to stake their ETH to be validated by the network. ICP's versions has nodes that produce a random number called a random beacon, which is applied to select the next group of nodes. This drives the platform's protocols. The tool is called the Threshold Relay Consensus Model, and it's one of the main aspects that make ICP what it is. So let me explain what ICP tokens are. The ICP token provides gas for the network and allows holders to vote on the proposals that will shape the future of the internet computer. Users create voting neurons, which enable them to either vote manually or automatically by configuring their neuron to follow other neurons. ICP is available to trade at a number of exchanges, notably being listed on Coinbase Pro immediately upon its launch. It's also listed on Binance, OKX, and Huobi Global, among others. What's the advantages and disadvantages of ICP then? The potential of what the internet computer could be is intriguing, but let's weigh out some of the benefits and drawbacks of ICP. As mentioned earlier, the potential of ICP could be quite endless. This means the scalability aspect of it can be unlimited. Security is also another advantage. Dfinity states that its system of checks is even more superior to Ethereum's. It's compatible with smart contracts, which means decentralized apps can be developed on the platform. Another advantage of ICP is its speed. As Bitcoin transactions can take around 10 minutes and Ethereum can take about 15 seconds subject to network congestion, but Dfinity claims that the internet computer can finalize transactions in one or two seconds. Because the internet computer is still fairly new, the protocol still isn't battle tested, and some people are arguing there's a great deal of exclusive code that is involved. However, criticizers are also saying that the blockchain being used is cautiously controlled and the true value of the protocol is uncertain. What's the future potential of ICP tokens? Well, cryptocurrency continues to evolve in many different ways. Even art is now a cryptocurrency. The internet computer is still in its early stages, but the many possibilities make the future of the internet computer fascinating. Being at the forefront of a potential new internet can be beneficial for early adopters and investors. The internet computer's purpose is to create a superior blockchain for the world to build upon. The idea of a platform controlled by a larger group of people instead of only a couple of tech giants is also interesting. If the internet computer does what it's set out to do, the way the internet currently is will change forever. 
It will be a truly open internet that also democratizes tech opportunities to a larger group of people. Only time will tell, though, the repercussions of the internet computer and how the rest of the world is affected. I know, I know, you're asking about whether it's a good investment or not. Well, ICP is a good investment mainly due to its strong technologic fundamentals. The internet computer is a fully operational, hyper-functional blockchain network designed as a complete ecosystem, able to compete with industry leaders such as Bitcoin or Ethereum. Essentially, the internet computer bridges the worlds of blockchain and the traditional web. The unique technology behind ICP called the Kane Chi technology allows connecting the computing powers of many computers around the world, effectively turning them into an extremely efficient and powerful decentralized computing unit. In practice, the internet computer can be explained as a blockchain able to operate with speed typical to modern day web applications. Imagine if sending blockchain transactions was as fast as loading a website in your web browser. That's essentially what the ICP does. When we look at the groundbreaking technologic fundamentals of the internet computer and its current as well as possible use cases, it's obvious that ICP is a good investment and that its massively successful public listing was not just a matter of hype and marketing. It may seem like the ICP is a project that came out of nowhere, but in reality, it's a functional ecosystem that was in development for years and can be considered a serious competition to blockchains such as Ethereum, Cardano, or Binance Smart Chain. So there you have it. That's basically all you need to know about Internet Computer and its ICP token. And now hopefully you have a better understanding of it, and if you should invest in it or not. And if you want to do that, check out the links in the description to get some discounts on brokers that offer this as an asset. If you want to learn more or help us spread these videos, please drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. That would be so much appreciated. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.